Lead Nigeria unveiled its 2024-2034 country strategy aimed at addressing the issue of poverty in the country. And this is part of the organization's ongoing efforts since 2004 to eradicate poverty in Nigeria, just like the man who saw tomorrow. Action Aid Nigeria started the journey to eradicate poverty in Nigeria with its first and second country strategy papers titled Fighting Poverty in the Midst of Plenty, Part 1 and 2, from 2004 to 2013. We have learned that poverty is multifaceted and cannot be compartmentalized. You cannot say this is what poverty is, just this area. And requires a more nuanced approach and engagement. In this current strategy, we are deepening our engagement in focusing on responding to multi-dimensional poverty. So when you hear about multi-dimensional poverty in Nigeria, what comes to mind? What comes to mind is 133 million. 133 million Nigerians living in multi-dimensional poverty. Um, as a learning organization, we strongly believe that the current Nigeria context would require us to innovate through a social movement mindset in acting to address multi-dimensional poverty that we face as a country. His position was further strengthened by the chairman of the Board of Action Aid Nigeria, Dr. Jumai Omar Ajijola, who stated that the call was perpetuated by factors that perpetuate poverty and injustice in the face of plenty in the country. That the fight to end poverty must be very intentional. It must be very collaborative. It must also be very innovative. And above all, it also has to be all in one person. In this respect, we are honored in your presence as we launch our new country strategy paper, which will have been Citizens Action to End Poverty and Injustice. Actually, it reaffirms its commitment to struggle against poverty and injustice, and our actions will reflect the urgency of the needs of the power of the poor and the excluded. The special guest at the occasion and uh, Honorable Minister of Budget and Planning, Abubakar Bagudu, while commending Action Aid for its positive impact in addressing multidimensional poverty in the country, urged youths in the country to issue anger and instead embrace dialogue with government to address the ma many economic challenges in the country. Thank them for what they have done and thank them in advance of what they planned to do. And the team is on citizen action to end poverty and injustice. It couldn't have been better tied because these are issues of fundamental nature to humanity. The ultimate end of social action is to include all. And local economies can be made to include all. And this can only happen when we embrace cooperation, when we become less judgmental, when we interrogate and challenge public officials to give more effort, more guidance. In his keynote address on social movement organization, the role of citizens and critical stakeholders in creating pathway in eradicating poverty and achieving social justice, Dr. Otive Igbuzo says this can on one condition be achieved through collaborative efforts by all Nigerians. The new strategy recognizes that the fight against poverty and injustice cannot be weighed by a single entity or through isolated efforts. It requires collective action, a movement of people united against poverty and injustice. In order to do this, involves empowering citizens, strengthening governance, advancing economic justice, promoting... Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.